a camera. <laughs>
loop cam from right here. You can park right here. Yeah, back them in well, my you car. don't need to be like right here. Yeah, no, no, no. Uh, yeah, exactly. So if, if I come in just like this, straight shoot Let's here, because that. these are ours. That's perfect. And we'll just stop as soon as my trailer hits I right wonder here. if he can move that truck and we'll get right close. Well, I guess this is, don't matter. It we doesn't can get matter. Right in. Okay, yeah. Okay, do if that. we just put the end of my trailer right here. That'll be perfect. And we'll so and, we'll, and then out. when we come in, I'll just hug that. Then. Okay. So let's just barely miss that. Yep. We'll come right in here. That's perfect.
man, that don't look good. Problems now, huh? This looks like a problem. I'm not sure what to do now. All right, well, we're literally a couple feet from the pavement. This is hard ground. That's soft ground right through there for some reason. It just softened right up. Hey, you've got your sticker you need. I don't do dumb. Just real soft out here. This whole area is just liquefaction. The old five ton about went down right there. This is the whole ground, look at this. Yeah, the pump is the Is that not? Yeah, was it sinking? Another motorhome stuck today. Decided to sink itself in the dry stuff. So we stuff we pulled them a little ways and it got really soft really fast trying to get back to the hard pack. So Cam brought the dozer down. We're gonna uh, hopefully get it kind of dished out here and give him a pull out. So see where we end up. You know it's bad when the dozer's sinking out of sight. going to do here is we're going to kind of dish this out a little bit so he can he can kind of get a little bit of a trough for them to have a gradual slope out we'll see what we end up with the biggest challenge with these motors homes is there's nowhere to hook they don't put any hooks on them it is over there we may have our work cut out for us even yet cam i almost think you ought to get two ropes and get him clear out on that before he tries to pull because i think the more we work this the softer it's going to get i know i'm almost wondering if we should do this i i agree with that So we've decided instead of messing around with this, the more we mess with this, the softer it gets. So we're gonna hook onto him with two ropes, get the dozer clear out there, then we're just gonna bomb it out of here. So Cam is Cam's going in all the way. He got himself a belly dish dug out there. See there? Oh yeah, look at that. And he's gonna get hooked up in there with this big freedom rope. We're gonna try to give this thing the old tugaroo without tearing it in half. You think AAA will cover this? <laughs> We're not telling it. <laughs> More of my insurance. <laughs> so this is his torch. So if something happens, it's on camp, not my side. Oh, man. Why did you I'm let your side do this, Jake? <laughs> I'm afraid he's going to not get it out.
going on here Not today? <laughs> Just out here, living the dream, having some fun. Holy smoke, did you see that old wave coming out of there? Yeah, I can't believe that. Woo! That is amazing. Oh, yeah. We're out here to UTV Takeover. We got Dozer Jake and the crew, Cam Frost. And that is a, hopefully the last motorhome we see stuck that bad. Yeah. Are you are you smiling now? I am. At least we're out. I oh. hope it's not toast, but I sure appreciate it. Thank you. So here we go, guys. We called that the wave coming out of there because the old motorhome was just a bouncing and a waving. <laughs> and I am so happy it's out. We're gonna cone this area off to make sure nobody else drives in here the best we can. And awesome. welcome to UTV Takeover, Hurricane, Utah. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Enjoy your stay. I will. I will. All right. Awesome. Thank you. Appreciate you bet. It.